Hey, I'm Max, and I'm going to show you how to build a content moderation app in Base Dash in 90 seconds. So in this example, we're going to be building a dashboard that looks like this. So it's going to be pulling data from a SQL database into this nice interface. You're going to be able to select a record and then review the contents of a comment and then decide if it looks good. You can unmark it as flagged. Otherwise, you can leave it here, and you'll be able to see all of your flagged comments in this view right here. This is really easy to do in Base Dash, so let's get to it. First thing we want to do is to create a collection page in our app. And so a collection page pulls data from one of the tables in our database. So let's pick the comment table. We get this little preview. This data looks correct to me, so I'm going to create a view. And then the first thing we can do is set a layout. And so we can pick the table layout like we had before. But in this example, I think a card layout makes more sense. We can also choose which of the attributes show up in each of the cards. And so I don't think we care about the ID or product. Let's instead show the user and created at. So we can rearrange that. That looks good to me. In the data tab, we can then choose what data shows up here. And so we can actually just do a join on the user table in a couple clicks like that, which then lets us enable these attributes that are coming from user. And so the one that we care about here is profile photo. And so what we can also do here is just set display as image, which is just going to show the images in the cards like that. Really simple. And then we also want to add a filter so that we only get comments that are flagged. So that's Base Dash. I hope you got some inspiration as to the kinds of apps that you can build with it. We've tried to make the experience as batteries included as possible. So you get everything from searching and filtering to real-time multiplayer and mobile support out of the box without having to code anything yourself. We're excited to see what kinds of apps you build with it.